everyone welcome back to our channel again so hello how are you here we are again and so what did back. you do so for today's video we will share with you my husband's application right. for 13a visa the, the, yes the 13a yes. yes so we did part of doing that too it and yes. some other things before that yeah. yes we will share with you what we, we did, did yeah so we'll talk about see what what happened and then we will have the white whiteboard again about what we did yes what about we've done these things yes. before and you will put them the next next time yes so yes, we'll talk yes. talking about it yes yes Is that okay yep all right so we will watch that yes okay okay all right thanks is their office here there it's a travel agency too and this is next to the Bureau of Immigration. Alright, so are you are you called a fixer? <laughs> no. Uh, just an agency, yes? Yeah, yeah there's an agency. All right, here's an immigration agency that we're going to probably use to do our 13A visa. Very helpful so far. Not that expensive. Less expensive than the one next door. <laughs> <laughs> so we will... Huh? No. We will keep you posted on our progress with that. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. So we're going to NBI office now because my husband needs to get his NBI clearance for the third day. Government place in the Magari. Most of the government agents are here, and there's the NBI. And LPO is right across the road, too, around the corner. And more other government agencies are in this block. Here's the NBI building, it's literally next to the road, but you need to look so that you will see it. Because look at the building. Like old hard. Uh, in the eye, we went to window three to get more stuff done. Need to fill up more forms and pay another 200 pesos to mail the thing. Thank you. And now my husband need to do fingerprint and biometrics in the windows too. Yeah. <laughs> Is that all? My husband getting biometrics fingerprints. Hi everyone, so we're here now at the parking Hello. lot of Jumagati Airport. As you see, there's the airport. We're going to Cebu because my husband needs to do his biometrics and immigration in Bureau of Immigration in Cebu. So we need to fly there and do his biometrics. So what do we go at Cebu? Are you going to do your biometrics, honey? Yes. For your 13A visa. Yes. Yes. So, yeah. See you later. <laughs> In case of water landing, your license is now indicated on the group of visa. Bye. And now what do I do? Our room guy 
guys when you enter the bedroom there's the clothes hanger that you can hang your clothes and here is the bathroom so yeah that's the bathroom but here's our room and it has nice aircon tv small fridge um heater water heater and stuff and yeah and here's the bathroom guys look it's so cool and it has the bathtub it is there so yeah that's our room for tonight here's the view of our hotel here's the view from our hotel guys we're on the 12th floor in toyoko inn j center mall you ready honey you ready for yeah, <laughs> it's so high it's look we're on the 12th floor and there's the mandawi so this is the view at night from our hotel Welcome to Cebu Cheese Center Mall We're here at our hotel room now. We're Hello. We're waiting for the breakfast and we're, we're gonna, gonna go gonna to eat in the morning, yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We're gonna go to the immigration office after. We're gonna do your biometrics. One three A. Thirteen A visa. Thirteen A. Yes, for what is it again? The third thirteen A thirteen A visa. Visa. Yes. So we have to do that stuff. Yeah, we will do his biometrics for today. Right. And yeah, we will go home after. So we apply the 13A visa in the agency. Yeah, so we this have to is, walk all day. Yeah. <laughs> seven in the morning. So this is the only time we're going to go to see Bruce to do his biometrics. And all we need to do is wait after right. that. So yeah. And see. we'll do... The white whiteboard. I'm gonna give you more updates we'll later the with board. the whiteboard. Yeah, we have whiteboard <laughs> doing this up. Yeah. We'll talk about that. Yes. Yes. All right. We'll see you. See you later, guys. And here's the cheese, the cheese center It's literally next to each other. It's like one big building. So we're going there now to do the buying. So many people. So we're here doing our <laughs> paperwork for our visa. This is not one of your videos, is it? No, I'm not oh, yeah. putting you. <laughs> yes, him. We're here at the J Mall. This is the old Bureau of Immigration office. And yeah, there's the new one right here. And there's more on the other side, supposed to be. We're waiting for the biometrics of my husband. Here's the immigration office. Where are you gonna do the biometrics? It's on the third one. So that's the video guys, um, as you see some of the videos are old because we took it months, right. yeah it's been one month yeah, that we, we took some of them. We're doing everything so we still have a few uh, things to do that and, and do it right, but the one we did what? So we get, we need to get his NBI clearance because it's one of the requirements when you apply a 13A yep, visa. Yep, yep. So we went to NBI office, we paid 150 pesos plus 200 to mail the documents yep. in Manila and the time frame for that is one month so we wait for one month for it to arrive then 
After one month, we went to Dreamland Travel to and Tours. Yes. That's, yes. That's the agency where we applied for his visa. And the payment for that is 21000 including right. the fees. Right. And so, so a lot of money to, to Yes, do it's trip. a lot of money, but we only need to go to Cebu to do the biometrics it one was time. It cheaper than the one that we did. Yes. The one was twice as much yeah this is is cheaper they than the other one because money. we charge thirty seven thousand right, right. for it and okay. they charge twenty one thousand only yeah. we apply the 13 a visa yes. we went to cebu to do my husband's biometrics so so my husband got his extension already yes, for six I months have to do that like everybody does yes, yes. but exactly. um because we applied the visa the processing of it to, will take four months and he only have two months left so we might extend his visa because that's what they told us you need yes, to yes, extend yes. your visa until mm. you're done the processing right. of everything so in a month or two we'll do all of this yeah, yes so with everything next yes. month we're gonna extend gotcha. this visa again yes. extension visa so that and it's still valid mm -hmm. until if we were married then we can do the i r a for you but if you're not married then you can just get the bi yes or you can get this. What do they call it? You there? can get SRRV right, right, visa right. if you're not married to a Filipina spouse. So. Yes. And that was pretty chill, pretty a lot because it's one, two, zero, zero one, months. If you're in armed forces of I, America, right, right. yeah, or in other country, yes. you can get it or pay it for $1,500 yes. right, right, right. only. $1,500 right, you need to pay yes. up front and yeah, you're good. Okay, so yeah, that's it guys. This is all our video. We're gonna give you right. more updates later if they're gonna give us update also about his application yes, yes. and yeah, all thank right. you for watching. Thank See you, you on much. our next Thanks video. Everything. Bye. Bye.